Right, OK, um, well, look, it's just a little announcement, because, um, as you know, Jane's getting discharged tomorrow. Um, so we've come to a decision. Well, she has. Um, Christian and Syed want us to spend some time with them up in Birmingham, and while we're there, we're going to use the time to find a flat. In Birmingham? No, uh, somewhere near Bobby. I thought you and Bobby had fallen out. Yeah, but that's probably because we didn't visit him very much. When all this is over, you're going to be a very rich man, Max. We all are. Yeah, as long as your dad keeps his side of the bargain. Well, of course he will. He appreciates all your hard work. Part of me is going to miss this place when it's gone, though. Warren, what can I get you? No, no, I'm all good. Yeah, sure. Hello, little man, you been good? Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, well, he's good as gold now. He screamed the whole way from Taunton to Reading. Oh. <laughs> How's your mum? Yeah, mum's good. Yeah? Happy? Sophie tells me she detected a bit of a wobble in you this morning. Well, I don't know where she got that idea from. I'm going to miss this place when it's gone. Well, because I've lived there the best part of ten years. Well, there's no room for sentiment here. I thought you had a contingency plan. Yeah, I do, and I don't want to use that unless I really have to. It's up to you. But don't mess up, Maxwell. How long does morning sickness usually last? Too long. Mm. And I'm sick of it. Your mum didn't spot it? No, she was usually at work before I got up. Not that she paid me much attention anyway. I take it you haven't told Lauren? No, she's moving back in with Ian, so I don't have to think about that for a while. Hang on, aren't you supposed to be picking Lily up from school now? No, I've sort of done. How come? People want to help stay, so why not let them? What people? Just... Martin? Whitney was busy and Carmo offered. What? You're letting that poisonous old witch look after our kids. That's what is the worst thing she can do. Look, you go back there now and you pick them up. I mean it. I was more worried about you. Well, forget about me. Just do it. Now. What's funny? It's just... It's just nice to see a bit of the old Stacey back. About this morning, look, Mum. What's there to say? You've obviously made your mind up. I, I should be used to it by now. The thing is... Did you really think that ludicrously over-the-top breakfast was somehow going to make me feel any different? I was just trying to make it special. This is what Jane wants, and... I can't please both of you. Come here. <laughs> it was only ever you I wanted out of the way, Jane. Not Ian. There's still unfinished business with him. What do you mean, unfinished business? Are you evil? What sort of a question is that? I can't think of any other explanation. Well, if I am, you've got to ask yourself why. <laughs> this has gone too far. If you don't go to the police, then I will. <sighs> I really didn't want to have to do this. Do what? Someone wants to say hello to you. Hey, Bobby. Who are you? Get that thing out my face. Don't worry, nothing's going to happen to him. Just as long as you do what you're told. <laughs> 